Hey, it's Nabo and yeah, I just wanted to say, of course, and tell us our video worth the career you want to stay in after one year or whether everything has changed or not. And yeah, let's look at the results. <laughs> Call centers are still shit. I don't know what anyone would be expecting, but yeah, they are very shit in terms of whether you want to stay here or not. Um, you know, just take it from myself. Nothing really changes, and if you talk, and if you remembered my previous video in relation to that, you would understand most of what I'm saying if you actually worked in the call center. So, we're talking about in terms of how performance is handled, in terms of career progression. I'm not sure if I mentioned career progression back in the previous video, but if you're talking about like career progression in a call center, do not expect that at all. The most closest position that you get to having a decent career is probably around that team manager level, but even then that takes like, I'm not going to say millions of years, but it's a lot of years that you need to make sure that you can basically get to that position, whereas with job helping, you can basically get to other positions that are probably better than call center industry and pay a lot more, but just drop them into another industry, if I'm being honest. So, yeah. If you're thinking about staying in a call centre for the, um, don't, and I promise you, you'll probably have a bit of time in terms of thinking about where you actually want to go for for your career. I'm, I'm doing literally doing that myself right now. <laughs> so, yeah. And, yeah, if you're a graduate who has a, um, probably a bachelor's, master's, undergraduate, you know, don't waste your time in a call centre. Just go for a graduate scheme and then you'll be fine. Honestly, just take it from me. But yeah, that's just a pretty short video for anyone who's actually in call center. If you're still in the call center with no jobs lined up, then yeah, that's fine. And all, just make sure that you get out of it as soon as you can. Make sure you perfect your interview skills, whatever. Do whatever you need to do. But anyone who has way more capabilities of getting out and going to better industries, then I suggest you do that right now. So yeah. But anyways... Hope you guys have a good day and yeah, take care.